This is one of these unique moments in life when we're not rehearsing. <laughs> oh, we got food coming out. This is no way. All right. All right. So this is today's one of the just got up today with Dan, who you just heard, to Arc 38, which is uh, the hub, one of the most active Occupy farms, and also the transit point between. Occupy and reclaim where we are building these solutions. It's, we're sitting here with one of our water tanks. We got our water catch system, harvesting a massive amount of pretty good clean water. Um, and we're, I want to show you all what the garden looks like and the plans for that because we need to get serious. So I just came up and it's been a while because I just uh, went on this this global trek for the global summit and my, my short pilgrimage in Haifa but we're gonna build a hoop house here that's the aim and we've got some cool stuff we could give out actually as four people supporting it you can tell right now we got some here I'll, this is weird we got some peppers we got tomatoes greens legumes beets Growing in this little quarter acre, we got an acre started even further down. Let's see, I'm sorry, this is, I'm like, this is the weirdest way to film ever. But right down there, there's like some extra really good developments. We're getting this, this stuff covered and, and, uh, and learning a lot. So there's quite a bit to share. But we have our water catch here as well, as well as these actually kind of cool, productive plants. The, the dye that comes from these is just unbelievable. It's beautiful, red. But um, we're going to build this pretty large hoop house. I'm going to do some estimates on that today. And uh, I don't know if this is how this is. If this is even recording. Yeah, it's still recording good. <laughs> these new frangle crazy, uh, crazy machines. So. You know, some people wonder what the heck we talk about um, in terms of uh, creating a sustainable alternative. It's always assumed that, that it means going into caves, but it's more like being Amish with the internet. Um, <laughs> it's like the best of all worlds. So um, this hoop house that we're going to do will probably be one of the largest hoop houses ever. Um, so it's about 30 by 30 feet. And it's not really going to be a hoop. I mean, it's going to be our, our winterized garden. So hopefully during the winter in New York, you guys will be seeing another video with me or one of our other people who is reclaiming this land uh, that's being threatened by a bunch of asshole predatory bankers um, and saying, no, this is, this is the people's land. This is, we're making it productive. Give us a chance and stop screwing over our friend Bill Henry and we'll see some of the adventures of Bill and Teddy and um, you know all the other really amazing fantastic servants of uh, public servants like Hunter Henry and Kelly um, there's just and uh, Terrence it's a really beautiful group of people who is who is really committed to this spot. So um, just stay tuned. We're going to do a much more professional kind of fu uh, fundraising video. We um, we have water up here that comes from uh, some springs that are perfectly clean and um, very special. So I think we'll. We've got some stuff that we could give out, some relatively beautiful, um, easy to find, forageable herbs that come from from this, this mountainous area. This is where we were before, but it's going to be too cold for us up there, um, except when we're really roughing it, which will be fun to share. Um, but this is your place to heal, to come up, to learn how to get back in touch with things and uh, there's a uh, train station right there 
So we're pretty accessible. And those people who kind of arise to support this, we've, we'd really like to thank by, by inviting them to be a part of it. Because um, now we, are, we realize that, well, for far too long, it's been a lot of young people who don't really want to get anything done and just kind of party. And that part of the movement's over. <laughs> Really, after a year, it's only those. After a year, and now the the energy bills coming through. It's pretty clear that it's only those of us who really want to get serious. So that's gotten that's kind of gotten cleared up. And uh, just stay tuned. We're gonna. I'll, I'll be sharing how this all goes over time. And uh, hopefully, the next week we'll have some firm estimates on on this hoop house and how you might be able to help and um, see this land become productive year-round and be a place for us to organize all the farming communities throughout this entire region um, from Manhattan all the way to western Massachusetts for a unified effort that can really put a stop to hydrofracking put a stop to this GMO crap and uh, create a, um, a real an, an arc for the next economy where we make our own currencies where we make our own value and uh, where we heal the wounds of the past not wallow in them so God bless, thank you